perineal massage mm -hmm. with oil. Okay, mm -hmm. that's when they start doing it between 32 weeks until the time of delivery. Mm -hmm. It is soft gel and makes the skin here elastic. Okay, okay? so that it can now expand. Okay. I think it's one of the interventions that is being practiced now to reduce uh, principal tears and mm -hmm. use the physical, which is a good intervention. But that one doesn't work. The only thing that can maybe, of course, the force, it depends on the force of contraction. Mm -hmm. When the, the baby is coming at a very fast rate, the risk of contraction is high. Okay? Now you have a mother bleeding and you're suspecting a survival care. What do we do when we have a cerebral tear? What we need to do is to take this mother for examination under anesthesia. Okay? Mm. That means we transfer them to theater. Mm. Okay? You, much as we can do it on the bedside, but that's not the best practice. Mm. 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 You, Samantha, may not be, you may not want us to do yours mm. at the bedside. Mm. Okay? As well as uh, my brother here doesn't I want, I want his wife to be done. But so don't do it to people's women. <laughs> <laughs> now, you're there. What you need to do is get to press and spread down. All you need to do is to retract, okay? To expose. Normally, the cervix would actually be close to the entrotus. Okay? So the cervix will be close to the entrotus. Okay? You'll be able to see. Okay? But how do you examine it? To pull out the tear. You can retract, you can retract on this side. Okay? The first thing is to identify a portion of the cervix, okay? Of the cervical edge, okay? Mm -hmm. Supposing this is a portion of the cervical edge, you have picked this is the cervix, okay? Mm -hmm. You leave this sponge holding faucet and always use only sponge holding faucet mm -hmm. or green summative. Okay, mm -hmm. you leave it at that point. That's the reference. Mm -hmm. You must examine it all round until you reach that point. You uh, use an additional one to check to pick a portion, maybe about four or five centimeters mm -hmm. eh, from the other one. You check is there a tear? We don't have a tear. Okay, and then you pick the other one. You pick is there a tear between these two points? No, no. there's no tear. You remove this one. Okay. Eh? You pick, maybe let's pick this other part, okay? Hmm? Is there a tear? Yes. There's a tear, okay? Mm -hmm. Now, you found the first tear. Maybe if you suspect more than one tear, normally it's important to examine. Mm -hmm. You get one more uh, spot on your faucet. And if it is a bleeding tear, you clamp after the apex. Okay? Mm -hmm. yes. You can bring them together like this, and then you clamp like that, okay? After the apex. Let me use this one to clamp. Okay? First you practice on where? Good, yes. Okay? Yeah. Climb up to that point.